Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and in this video I'm going to show you the simplest way to complete this lab. So first of all, just simply log in with your local credentials and once you're done with that, just simply come back over here and the first thing that you have to do, you have to click on this enable development mode option. Just simply click on this toggle, make sure that you have to enable this toggle otherwise you are not able to edit the files. And once your toggle is enabled, then click on this develop option like this way and then click on this quick lab flights over here. Just simply click over here. Now it will take a couple of seconds to load the data. Meanwhile, in the description box of this video i will share one github link just simply click on that link and then you are able to access this document now what you do you have to just simply copy this document so just simply copy like this way come back over here now here you can see general just simply click over here and then click on this flights over here like this way now here you can see faa dot model just simply click over here so file is open now just simply scroll down now here you can see from the line number 46 just simply click over here hit enter button couple of time and now just simply paste the command which is just copy from here like this way now click on the save changes over here wait for a second and it's done now click on this validate look ml it's so it's validating so just simply wait and it's done now click on this commit now just simply type any message over here like this way and then click on this commit over here wait for a couple of seconds and now just simply click on this deploy to production it will take a couple of seconds so just simply wait for that and it's done now what you do here you can see looker just simply open this thing new tab like this way now just simply click on this looker again wait for a couple of seconds and then click on this explorer over here and here you can see airports inside that faa then click on this And it's done now here you can see quick lab task one just simply click over here now for the task number one you don't have to make any other changes just simply come back to the lab instructions and just simply click on the task number one just simply scroll down and here you can see from the line number 13 you can see this name so just simply copy this name carefully do not copy this last full stop just simply copy like this way come back over here now here you can see gear icon just simply click over here click on the save and just simply choose the existing dashboard just simply choose that now just simply replace the name over here like this way now what you do again come back over here and from the line number 15 just simply copy this name carefully again do not copy this last full stop just simply copy like this way come back over here click on this new dashboard just simply paste the name which is just copy click on the save and it's done now here you can see it's come up now click on the save to dashboard and it's done now if you just simply come back over here and click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue just simply wait and watch now for the task number two we have to make couple of changes so basically what you do you have to come back over here and click on this dashboard now again click on this explorer over here then again click on this airports over here wait for a couple of seconds and then click on this quick lab task 2 over here like this way now here what two changes you have to do first of all here you can see in the visualization you have to just simply click on this bar icon like this way now here you can see a row limit just simply type 5 over here make sure that you have to make these two changes and once done with these two changes make sure that you have to click on this run just simply click on this run wait for a couple of seconds and it's done now again click on this gear icon and then again click on this save again just simply choose the existing dashboard like this way now for the title again come back over here click on the task number two scroll down a little bit and from the line number 18 you can see this name so just simply copy this name do not copy this last full stop just simply copy like this come back over here and just simply paste over here like this now here you can see airport and flight dashboard just simply choose that like this way and then click on this save to dashboard and it's done now if you just may come back over here and click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue and if the score is not updated no need to worry just simply wait for a couple of seconds and the score will update for sure and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please do let me in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys